What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Jazz Marie, aka She Have It All. I'm out here in Williamsport, y'all. I know I had to recoup for a minute because I haven't done a drive before. It was like three hours. It wasn't too bad with the kids and everything. Got here in good time. We caught up a little bit um, with the family and everything, so we're going to hang out today. Right now, we're about to go get uh, something to eat. The kids is uh, at the room with their Aunt Trima right now. They ate earlier, so right now, Manny Murray. Oh, I'm sweating, y'all. Sorry. Manny Murray about to go get something to eat at Fridays because it got the nerd to be right next door to the hotel. And y'all know I love me some Fridays. Say what's up, Murray. What's up? <laughs> yep, so I already know I'm getting me some, some ribs. Um, and we actually going to dine in. And I'm gonna take y'all with me because they we are they uh they had uh, green out here, so they stores and stuff just opened back up. So yeah, about to go in here and bust a grub. Alrighty. What's up? I'm back. So we inside. We just got seated and everything. We just ordered our drinks. Nothing fancy. You girl got a margarita. And I'm about to see what I'm gonna get. I'm just gonna play around with this menu because I already know I'm getting some bread. So the good thing is y'all look like it's they seat and everybody um six feet away, six feet apart. Everybody looks like to be six feet apart. All the staff is still wearing masks. Um and then they got disposable menus. So that's what's up. They got disposable menus. So I'm about to go ahead and take a look at my menu, even though I already know what I want. I'm just trying to see exactly what I want for my rig. You see uh Look at uh, on the appetizers. They got this right here. What is that? Big bucket, a bucket of bones. Didn't you get that before? No. That's wings and, and ribs. And that'll be up your alley. Friday's big ribs with signature whiskey glaze, traditional wings. Toss the apple butter barbecue sauce and season fries. Yeah. That ribs and wings? Yes. Yeah. What is that, half a rack? They say big, big ribs. That sounds really good, though. Big ribs with signature sauce. I think that's a full cool Big ribs. I think instead of the fries, I'll do the broccoli, though. That's a good substitution. Yes, I'm just going to rack up full rack of big pork ribs. Basically, I'm going to choose the sauce with seasoned fries and coleslaw. That seemed really good, though. Home of the original appetizers. Okay, that might be enough for me because I was already going to get some um, boneless wings for my appetizer. Oh, and right now, y'all, I'm using my small tripod that I got from Five and Below. It's really coming in handy at places like this, and I don't got to worry about trying to set my phone up and sit somewhere. And I love that they have this back here, so I don't have to catch the back of nobody head, and nobody ain't got to be all up in my bi. Okay, because they have been. <laughs> Tell you. So yeah, I think I'm gonna try the bucket of bones. <laughs> That's what they called it. They need a soup. Mm -hmm. I did want a salad. Ooh, white cheddar broccoli soup. I can't have it all, can I? I did want a salad though. White cheddar broccoli soup. Okay. Ain't that what mm -hmm. you usually get? Cheddar, cheddar, cheddar broccoli, probably cheddar. Broccoli and cheddar. Let me see if I can do this real quick. Just to see if I can get both. Sorry. Sorry, you're fine. Oh, my man, I'm just recording. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm trying to get. I don't think I can get this both, right? Take some of this. Okay. But I'm trying to. I think we're too far apart. Unless I just actually hop on your side. <laughs> I just hop on your side. <laughs> no, you still see when you turn around, I can see some of you at least. It's like the ladies want to see just for the lips and the, the bottom half. So if you just put the light skin lips on, you're good. Anyway, y'all, my margarita is here. And y'all just missed the whole kitten caboodle. Absolutely tried. We got a long hour. So he told me that y'all do. He told me that you put the bucket of bones. I said, okay, you know what's going on. 
Let me try to buck the bone. So I ordered the buck the bone. And then he going to order the season and chicken. Something. So I'm like, well, why are you on that? We just said that we didn't get the buck of the bone. And he was like, oh, well, I thought I could probably just nibble off of yours. But I'm getting mine as an, an entree. So why does that even make sense? You're not nibbling off my entree if I can't nibble off yours. Uh, you can always nibble off mine. I want to nibble off yours. Because you get season chicken and shrimp. Now, if that was the case, then we should both should have had another ingredient or something else. That we both possibly wanted to try. Uh, I just actually wanted to try wings. Nah, it's part of my entree. So you made me buy my whole another wing? Yes, because you we were supposed to be getting an appetizer and you tried that wing. You planted the seed and you watched it grow. And I fell for the okey dough. I'm, actually, I want to try that apple butter. I'm going to get apple butter. The apple butter barbecue. Well, it ought to be on my wings. So. Apple butter barbecue. Did you want to deep thought then? I did go in deep thought. Is this something that you would like to express to the people? Yes. So, did you see my last video? What the last video that I posted? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure. You did not see it. No, it was the one when uh, huh? Popeye. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I was there when you recorded it. Not the beginning part when I was in the car and I was talking. So you obviously didn't see that. No, I didn't see that part. I know you didn't because I didn't hear about it yet. So. But she was talking about me? A little bit. I didn't say a whole lot, but yes. Oh, hell no. <laughs> watch this shit. I only said a video, you ain't even let me say nothing. You gonna watch it. But uh, I just wanted to, I just wanted to why you didn't say that's the body yet. Yeah. But I didn't say much, I was talking about, you know, our relationship, and I'm not sure like where we at, we're having a lot of problems. I said we have a lot of ups and downs, and we're working through them. That's for sure. And we are working through them. Yeah. 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 She dragged me out there. She dragged me out there to find chicken. And they got mad when I got mad at the people because they didn't have her chicken. No. I told people what happened about them not having my chicken, but I didn't tell them about what happened when we were going crazy over them not having a chicken sandwich. <laughs> no, it was because they didn't have her chicken. No, he was going crazy because they didn't have his chicken sandwich. She said we had the classic chicken sandwich, but she didn't have the, chicken, the classic chicken sandwich. And they wanted pickles. All the pickles. I know. pickles. And, so, and they wasn't going to make it anymore. So we started tripping out about that. I left that part out. <laughs> the only people who eat pickles are 10 year, girl, 10 year old girls from the 90s. They used to get the little packs of pickles, walk around and biting on them. Nasty. Is that all you said? Is that all you said in your, your video? Yeah, that's all I said. She have it on? Yes, that's all I said. I'm pretty sure. Nothing more, nothing less. So then I went on to tell, tell them all that, right? Comment below. You already know if you've seen the video. I was, that's all I said. Because y'all know I don't know what to let out and what not to let out. What to put out there and what not to put out there. So, I mean, if you would like to speak to that, then I'm allowing that here because you didn't have a chance there. Um, no. Nope. Though he should be already supporting you and he should have already watched the video by now. But that's for another video and another day. I'm a hard working man. Still gotta pay the bills. She gotta put some. <laughs> Never mind. So, yeah. I'm still going to do the barbecue ribs for cooking with Tracy, of course. Um, like I said, I watched her. Uh, he, loved life. he loves life was talking about her. In her last video, when she had passed away, she used to always eat barbecue ribs on her uh, muffins. So, I mean, we have some ribs, but they can have whiskey, whiskey glaze sauce, but I love my JD. That's old man. So, I'll go from there. Still gonna do 
right now. I don't even want to say that out loud. I know that. Right. Alright, so that was well said. It actually, I started to believe it. <laughs> but then I remembered I was right. So, this is true. I do know her dad, which is a different age group bracket than I am. So, I might not want to partake in everything they partake in or, uh, you know, talk about. Might even not be entertained. So, with that being said, yeah, I did meet some of her family once for like an hour or two. That, Don't try to know you was there. We were there all day. Did I, I didn't talk to those people though. So you introduced you? No? Okay. But I still don't know them. Just okay, cause I, I'm, I know what I'm saying. You met them, but yeah, you don't. Uh, I, I didn't interrupt you though. So okay. She interrupted me. So trying to throw me off. I get thrown off easy. But not today. The facts, honey. Look at the facts. We, the facts. We okay. Facts the, facts is, the, the facts is that I don't know nobody. Well, yeah, I could stay on my own. But if it was vice versa, yeah. I would be like, you know what, we're down here with my peoples. I'm not just going to tell you to either figure it out or or just drop you off somewhere. You know, I'm going to set some just shit up. I'm going to set some shit up, stuff up, and make sure you're good. And not just say, all right, well, you got to figure it out. Okay, no, you're good. Thank you. And that's how I felt. I felt like she was just saying, all right, well, basically, this is what I'm going to do. You met some people, so you can make your own plans and figure stuff out. Which, to me, it, it doesn't make sense. We're here visiting your family, so this first time, first time down here. So maybe after this time, you know, after the four days we're gonna be here, I get to chill with them more and more. I can be comfortable, like, oh yeah, call them up, like, yo, what you doing? I'm about to come through. I can't just do that right now. I don't know about it. Okay. Look, look. So, like I said, y'all heard, um, y'all heard, y'all heard both sides of the story. Comment down below who's right, who's wrong, or just your opinion on maybe how I could have better handled it. But you heard how he took it, how he took what I said. You heard exactly Thank how I presented you. it. Uh, I feel like he's saying that I can't spend that alone time with my family, which I don't think should be an issue at all. I'm not leaving him hanging. I'm not leaving him for a whole day. Um, but you know, just let me know. It's, it has nothing to do with spending a long time. She can do that. I left for like five hours. She had a long time then. So it can happen. What I'm saying is, we woke up this morning. I left this part. We woke up this morning, and she asked me what I was doing today. It was a joke. She said it was a joke. All right. Anybody who knows me know what I'm joking. For some reason, eight years, still doesn't know me. I was freaking joking. It, and I know it hurts his soul. It hurts his soul when I do stuff like that. So I woke up, and I had a whole bunch of smile on my back. I said, well, uh, what you doing today? And he's like, huh? I'm like, what you doing? They got plans. Of course, it's a damn joke. All right. So she she said, "What am I doing today?" I'm like, uh, "What do you mean by that?" I, I was going off. I didn't know. She said, "Oh, I was thinking." She said it was a joke, but then saying, "Oh, I was thinking, you know, you can chill my dad, or you know, chill in the room, get some rest." What the hell is that? That's what I feel like I'm being tossed aside. So I understand if it's gonna be a girl's day. Let me come over, let me see that for myself and be like, you know what? I gotta get out of here. Yo, call somebody. Do anything. Or, but she didn't even know if it was gonna be guys there. It's all females. I seen them with their dudes every time I'm just seen them. So. That's a lie. Who's the baby? My cousin uh, Bianca was with a man. Brittany, why is Brittany, dude man? pulled up. He was sitting in the chair. The boy with the Muslim kufi on. He pulled up in the truck. Okay, I didn't see Brittany. And then. What is that uh, Patrice's house? Patrice, she doesn't have. A man as far as what I know, or the It's nothing else to do that here. So, we don't know if the man was going to come. So, she didn't say, All right, you know what? Let me ask and see exactly what's going to be going on here. Could have easily did that and said, All right, it is going to be all girls. They ain't no dudes going to be there. Give me the chance to say, All right, you know what? Let me, oh, let me find some I don't get as to, I'm going to just, no. Because that doesn't matter. Because I'm down here with family, with my family. Like I said, my Ask me, so you guys. No, I, no. I too am also family. Right, and then we're gonna move on from this. But I too am family. So you can't just say I'm here with my family because we're all family. Or eventually. Maybe. So you didn't watch my last video? Is what you're saying. I already came to the conclusion I didn't watch it. I'm 
like I said, is that why I don't, I don't get it? I'm trying to have a fun video, trying to eat my food, and um, this type of stuff is annoying me. Because I don't feel like it should be an issue at all. I don't. So it's cool if I just drop you off with some family? I didn't know. just drop you off anywhere. Where, who did I drop you off to? Ooh. Or did I give you options? Which one, guys? Mm -hmm. Give me options. Okay. Hi y'all. Anyway, my food is here. Hold up, I'm trying to let y'all see my bucket of bones. So this is the bucket of bones. I didn't get the fries, I got a side of broccoli. Got the sesame chicken shrimp. Also a side of broccoli right there. And this is the bucket of bones. And the chicken is underneath it. Chicken and shrimp. Nothing sizzling. And second of all, this is the chicken that they gave me. You see this? Over here. That's the only chicken in the tray. The only chicken. So I'm about to complain.
you guys know the facts. I don't want you guys to look at the curls and, you know, just automatically take my side. They are nice curls. Um, but the facts are the facts. You got to pay attention to the facts. First time here, don't know anybody. That's it. I know nobody. I mean, I can go make friends with people. You know, I'm pretty sure she wouldn't like that. Uh, just let's go on the facts, people. Shit. Let's Shit. let's go on the facts. Okay, people. <clears throat> Thank you so much for listening to me today. And as the should I call you the defendant or what are you the opposing? Yeah, I'm um, not sure. But as he has stated, um, go off of the facts. I told you what it is. I would be the prosecutor because I'm coming at you. Okay. So I would never. Um, do those things or make anybody feel uncomfortable or leave anybody behind. Um, I just also think that. Right here. Can I have this so I can uh, keep this with my point? Yeah, do you have your number for your um, like, you know, phone number? Because yeah. that's how I can add that one up for you. You want you to put it on yours? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, yeah, man. Yeah. Well, no, you can put yours on, your, on there and then I'll put this one on mine. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Well, now I'm going to pause this. Wait a minute. <laughs> Who's paying the bill? But she brought me two gold sauces, y'all. She's really good. Some Jack Daniels and some ranch for my wings later. So that's what was awesome. Um, we guess, like I said, I would never leave him hanging. That's not the issue, not the fact. Nope. He already knew that he didn't know here. Knew uh, everybody when he came here. But yet, in fact, he knew my he knows my father. No, I was looking for you too. Talk about your great service. Uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm on two goes today. Oh, okay. Tonight, so I'm, Around. But oh, okay. In the, in the I back. knew I was. I recognized you. I want to see if that was you or not. Yeah, no, it's me. No, no kids today. We snuck away today. Snuck huh. We snuck away today. Hey, okay. take it when you can, right? Yeah. Especially now that you actually can. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't get the name, but anyway. See, I'm such a great person. I would never do that to him. I would never do it to him. I basically was letting him know, oh, hey, my aunt said this. I didn't think it was an issue. So maybe you can, if, if, if. If he just was hanging out with the guys the day before, it was not an issue. Hanging out with the guys, he was doing guy things. This is my closing argument. You already did yours, so after this, you can't say anything else. That's the whole point <laughs> of the closing argument. But Yo, yeah, but if you end, you I'm not ending. I'm just. It. This is the closing argument. You got to put your heart, blood, and soul into the closing right, argument. She put these on for you, my manager, okay. and she said once you update those points, they should all go in there. If they don't, just like call us and we'll show you how to do it for you. Okay. okay. All right. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. So yeah, guys. Without without further ado, I'm just gonna try to keep it real, real solid and sweet. Y'all already know where my heart was coming from. It wasn't coming from a place where I'm trying to leave him hanging, leave him in a situation by himself because I would never do that. Um, but I also am here with my family. It is very. Um, I don't see them often, and and why not? You know, when she asked me that, why not? And if he did come, what would happen then? Or would he feel uncomfortable? Which I know him, and he would. He wouldn't want to be around a whole bunch of people. So like I said, guys, comment down below where you stand. Um, are you with me? Are you with the opposing team? Just let me know. Um, good looks travel far, but hey, like you said, don't let that contribute to any of your decision making here today. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, let me know, y'all. Let me know. I'm gonna be back, though. I'm gonna be back with the fans. I'll see y'all later. Peter. <laughs>